For life. Thank you, Scarlett. Thanks for the call. Really appreciate it. Thanks for reminding me. I need to go and watch a Christmas story. Let me say, A Wonderful Life has become this Christmas classic. Everybody watches A Wonderful Life on Christmas. I remember that when I was a kid, it was on every channel in the days before cable. Every channel was showing It's a Wonderful Life. You couldn't miss it. And I can't stand It's a Wonderful Life. I can't stand that movie for so many reasons. But primarily because it's about this person who has dreams about living this amazing life, going to Paris, you know, uh, 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 living a glamorous, exciting, fulfilling, wonderful life. And then, because of circumstances, giving up all those dreams, sacrificing everything he lived for, everything he dreamed of, everything he wanted, and staying to run against a family bank, and then really doing a lousy job doing that, so the bank is basically bankrupt, and, and being miserable, really, really miserable, not enjoying his life, not valuing his life, not to the point of wanting to commit suicide. And the argument about not committing suicide, if you remember the story, is all the good he's done other people. Oh, don't worry, your life is crap, you're miserable, you are not enjoying what you're doing. You're not good at what you're doing. Uh, you have not fulfilled your dreams. You have not followed your passions. You didn't marry the woman you really wanted to marry. You didn't go to see the world like you really wanted to see it. You didn't do all the things you really wanted to do. But you know what? You helped a lot of people. So you, so everything's okay. No, your life should not be measured by the value you provide other people. Your life should be measured by the value you provide your own life, by how good your life is. And again, I'm not talking about material good. I'm just talking about how good you are. You're, you're, doing, you're, you're working at a career you love, and that career could be a career that doesn't produce a lot of money. That's okay. If you love it and you're enjoying it and you're getting a huge amount of value out of it. Life should be about marrying the person you admire, you respect, you, you love fully you know a, a good life should be about making the most of your life living your life to the fullest i, I love i love that i think it's the, the the army slogan be the best that you can be i love that that is great because that's that should be our motto in life be the best that you can be use all your faculties to be the best human being you can be. Which means think out your life plan on how to make your life the most meaningful it can be. Right? I mean, it, but think about it, it, and that is, that is what it should be about. Yeah, you want to help other people? Fine. If it's not a sacrifice. Two minutes. If you're not losing through the exchange. Make this a trading holiday, not a sacrifice holiday. You want to you wanna send money to, uh, 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 to charity? Again, make sure it's a charity you believe in. So, again, Christmas, great holiday, particularly in America. Why is it a great holiday, particularly in America? Because America's commercialized it more than any other country in the world. I love Christmas because it's commercialized. I love Christmas because of the lights and the lights by the way are there to draw you into the mall draw you into the stores draw you into places where you can buy stuff for yourself and the people you love that's who created the lights it was the macy's parade it was santa claus right where does santa claus santa claus is not about he's the jolly guy he's happy not. he's not about sacrificing he's about having fun all the stories we read it's all about enjoying and celebrating life. Even the tree, the Christmas tree. We bring in a Christmas tree. We bring in an evergreen, a plant that survives the winter when it's freezing cold and it lives in spite of that. And we bring it into our home to symbolize life. And we decorate it to symbolize happiness and lights and friendship and the wonders of the universe. So, go out there Monday, 20. celebrate, have a good time, enjoy your family and friends, I certainly will, and um, 
You know, remember, this is a time, Ten. this is a holiday about your values. All right, we'll be right back after this break. 